So let's get to this. Uh, the mask, the coronavirus, it's also affecting sports in Arizona. Mm-hmm. High school, the high school level yep. and collegiate level. Yep, yep. You, sir, and I've been, been harping on this. I am so proud of you, dog. You don't even know how proud I am. I wish, I wish you, I wish I could show you more. You are a fucking coach. Appreciate it, man. No, because I actually know that you're gonna make some some football players better. It's, oh man, I'm about to turn. You a good. Little... You are a great football player, bro. Oh, I know. Man. I know you gonna really pass some game, and you ain't gonna not. You gonna give up all the jewels. I'm just trying to give the, these kids a cheat code of life, man. Cheat code of life. Cheat code to the game. And, and, and why? I, I, pre- I, I mean, I. I, I no, I'm, I'm gonna man. keep on giving one more thing. The reason why I say this is because. When, when I was playing with him, he didn't have he was cool enough to help me while in my football career. Even though that we were competitive as fuck and we were always trying to outdo each other each week, he would always try to make true. sure my game was all on tight, and he always made sure I was focused played, enough. And I had every like you get you gave me everything you know, and I, and I appreciate that. I played, I played two different positions. And I was still trying to take this nigga's job. I don't know why. I was trying to play both, like D tackle and DN. What's gonna happen? I know. What's gonna happen? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm too, I mean, I'm too good for that. Coach Brindley wouldn't let it happen. No, 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 no. My talent wouldn't let that happen. <laughs> and I'll say that again, baby. I got a eyewitness, Taylor. Right. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Taylor, I ain't gonna lie. Can, can I just can, run I, the huddle clips? No, 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 no. Run no, the huddle no, clips. No, 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 no. I just want to get this out the fuck away. I don't brag about myself like that. But no, but you. I, you were a dog. I'll brag about you because you was fun to play with. You was a funny man, man. Not like not just because I just know you personally, but you was dog. I, didn't you flip somebody? <laughs> was that you that flipped somebody one day at practice? We were doing one on ones. On the fudges? Was it the fudges or was I it just, Artie? I Damn. I know I bull rushed someone. Was that the, you that flipped Artie like that? Yeah. When we was at camp. Yes. Oh my God. I got mad because they were talking dumb. Oh, okay, it was you. I had it. Okay, look, listen. <laughs> I've never seen nobody bull rush somebody's single arm and then this whole man does a backflip afterwards. I'm like, I ain't gonna lie, bro. You're you're one of the bigger men I knew that had a motor and your motor never stopped. Out of, out of you and Jerron, y'all motors never stop, bro. Thank you. So I that and that's why that's why I think you had a motor and you you were that's why my my technique you were talking all the shit it was funny because like <laughs> niggas really thought really niggas really thought that you was like soft but you had a motor that just like just imagine Vince Wilford like that's how you that's how you that's what you reminded me when you played was a Vince Wilford but you could really move sideline to sideline hey my, hey babe you see why I was always insecure. Niggas always thought I was that, soft. That, that was see, funny. Niggas see? did always think more, uh, uh, that uh, Brent was pretty soft, man. I ain't gonna lie. I, I thought, was a I nice thought, ass dude, and niggas trying to come for my head. But then we would get into the weight room, like I was like, okay, this nigga can throw some weight and shit. And then like we get out there in the field, my nigga was throwing bodies around, I'm like holding okay. my own. Yeah, you did your thing, man. You I'm did soft. your thing. I'm just gonna say this: I I wasn't the best player on that defensive team every year, but damn near top three or five. I always made it known. But I'm just going to get this off. Hey, babe, I called your name three or four times. How I good How good was I? <laughs> you were fantastic, baby. Look. Thank you. That's all right. I'd be like, babe, remember my name? She'd be like, mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't I'm really like, be talking. I don't, I don't, like, talk, I don't nah, talk about I my football lie. highlights. Like, I don't bring that shit up with you that much. I ain't going to lie. I, I kind of. I was there. I went to every game I could. Yeah, I true. always try to put on a show. I was like, I got. In state, out of state. In state, out of state. Yeah. She. Ride or die. I I ain't gonna lie. I should have I should have married Taylor a lot quicker. My young ass didn't understand. Not a lot of girlfriends. When I first met you, you was like, "Yeah, bro, I'm married." I was like, "I'm engaged." I said, "Hold on, wait, what?" <laughs> My nigga was 18. I said, "Hold on, bro." Niggas did not say that. You did, bro. Niggas did not say you that. You literally did, bro. When I stepped on campus, I'm like, "Oh, what's up with <laughs> you, bro?" Like, you know, we introducing ourselves and shit. This nigga was like, "Yeah, bro, I got a, I got a wife. I got a fiance." I said. <laughs> I said, I said, well, hold on, wait, you got both? A wife and a fiancé? <laughs> yeah, a fiancé and a wife. It's all the same. You know, all in one category. I'm like, damn, Brent. Damn, nigga, how old is you? 18, big dog. 18. 18. <laughs> if y'all ever, if, hey, niggas that know Brent, big dog. Yep, yeah, dog. Mm-hmm, dog. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> that's that son nah, that's that coming that out bro, of bro from Fifth Floor, man. That, that's my nigga Brent, bro. Be like, what up, Brent? Chillin'. 
This is how you knew Brent was high coming to school. This is what I start realizing when he showed up high to school. This is what I said. Hey, 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 you better bring your ass back over here. No, yeah. Hey, no, where you running from? You're skinny now. You can fit through shit like that. But look, listen, listen, listen. This had to be the funniest shit, though, y'all. This is when I knew my nigga started getting high. This nigga would come to school, bro. I'd be like, oh, what's up with you, B? This is, this is when Brent would always be like, oh, what's up with him? Hey, 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 hey. Try to go chick flight, chick flight. He always do shit like that, right? That's why I knew when Brent started getting high. Hey, what up, Brent? What up, G? I'm just chilling. Oh, okay, okay. That's tight. That's tight. Then I look at Kane like, bro, what the fuck around this nigga? Hey, who the fuck is this nigga? Y'all ever seen the weed commercial and be like, I don't know Sally anymore? <laughs> oh, I, don't know, I don't know Sally anymore. Oh, My God. nigga Brent. Nothing. Just chilling. Cool. This nigga said hey, I man. started noticing hey, when you hey. started getting high. You shit. and Bobby, you and Bobby, Bobby over there talking about this. <laughs> Bye, Bobby, <laughs> Bobby, <laughs> niggas were Bobby. Reckless. We gotta, we gotta go, Bobby. Niggas was reckless with the pens. We gotta, bro. We gotta go, Bobby. Niggas Let's was go. reckless with the pens. My nigga Bobby be like, right, oh yeah, yeah. Let's bounce like titties. <laughs> <laughs> I said, what the, the hell is going on? I said, who the fuck is... That nigga Bobby said, let's bounce like titties. Let's bounce like titties. Oh, that is hilarious. Man, hey. Shout out to Bobby Elam, man. Shout out to Nick. Big. Hey, man. Shout out to Bobby. Hey, that's the only nigga I knew that would always be in the library. Now, there was a lot of niggas that was always in the library, but... Hello. Bobby and Brent, bruh. <laughs> if there was Bobby, we'd be like, where's Brent? I don't know. There's Brent, where's Bobby? CG all day. I don't know. But shit, you trying to go to Chick-fil-A? <laughs> you trying to go to Burger King, get them rodeos? Bro, I was always trying to get the fuck up out of school, bro. Man, bro. Any reason to. Oh, my God. Any hey, fucking reason. Let me tell y'all bro. something, bro. 2017, man, going into that 2017 season. Brent, me, and Kane, <laughs> we all decided to go to Red Lobster. <laughs> Pitch Chapel. And we went to Red Lobster. It's like 11 a.m., y'all. Straight the fuck up. We just got that check. We just got the. Oh, yeah. We just got the stipend check. Said, fuck it. We going to Red Lobster. I am about to say, you want to do a real quick dance? Because we want to imitate that, too. Oh, yeah, man. This is how we was feeling that day. Yep. Funny as shit. Get up early. Make my son a sandwich. Grapes and carrots. Keep my lightweight health. Clean. Like I'm back to school. 10th grade. Nigga, had the pack to tour. Pack to tour. Yeah. Now look, that's the ride to Red Lobster. Oh God. We pull up, the shit ain't even open yet. So we sat there again, and we did mold this. Then after that, we went into Red Lobster, man, and bust down. I had the soup. That's all I really wanted. Man, that nigga came oh, looking and, at and you and the We got the crab cakes. We got uh the shrimp. Hey, look, we that's busted I was down. To keep my figure. You feel me? I was doing that intermittent fast and shit. I was like, I ain't supposed to be eating around this time, but you know, fuck it, I'm fucking with y'all. You know it's so mean? funny when you try to see niggas that are trying to be on a diet but not really on a diet. You just look at them. They just licking their lips like I'm gonna eat this behind I'm your like back. Like a damn dog. I'm gonna eat. <laughs> like a goddamn I'm gonna eat McDonald's dog. behind y'all back. But damn, we just ranted. Can we? You want to get on topic real quick? I mean, shit, we was on topic. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to say that's more on topic than it could be on topic. <laughs> could this be our best episode? I don't know, Tay. Could this be our best episode? Absolutely. Oh, wow. To the next episode. To the... Then it's got the feeling. I don't but you're our coach. You are a coach. And how are you... Because this is your first year. And your mm-hmm. first year, you're actually getting fucked. Because of the coronavirus, you're not actually Damn, why being. Why you say it like that? Well, because here's my thing: you're not getting to actually be engaged with your kids around this time. You're st- you'll be doing summer football training, correct? True. This is a crucial time for y'all to get ready before the season True. to mesh, to understand the plays, to understand each other. Mm-hmm. You got to learn how you're gonna coach these boys because not everyone, not everyone's the same. True. That so, is true. 
How is this first year for you? This whole pandemic. Tell, I did not picture all this, but it's going. It's really not that bad. We've been doing these Zoom meetings with the kids, and you know how high school is, man. You some kids will show up, some kids won't. The only time they really show up when it's time to play, you know what I'm saying? The week before. Yeah, like the, you know what I'm saying? Like some kids miss practice, some kids don't. Type, you know what I'm saying? So that's what it's kind of been like so far. But I'm really not tripping because like we got a solid squad that we we got eleven. That's all I need. So let's keep it a band. Just keep it in a band. But you know the kids is cool. They they dope. Like the ones I met so far, they're eager to to learn and just ready to get get out there. So it's gonna be exciting, man. The coaching staff that I'm working with, I'm loving it. Like the coaches is cool. The vibe is there. Like we have a good diverse of people. You got your blacks. You got your whites. You got your Mexicans. It's cool. Like and it's in the hood. I like it. You know what I'm saying? Like. I, I just feel like I'm at home. Like I feel like I'm at Decatur High School all over again. You I know you feel like you feel like you know these kids. Yeah, you see you yourself in these kids. Yeah, exactly, bro. Okay. I do. Okay. I do. I do. So you know, it, that's where we're at. And so, so are you guys doing? How are you guys practicing with these kids? Are you guys is are you guys sectioning them off? Yeah. So so how these workouts are going to go right now? Like we have, uh, there's like time slots that these kids have to come into and there only 10 can be within each time slot, but they have to be with this group of 10 throughout this whole summer workout until we see what phase two is like. You know what I'm saying? We're in phase one right now, so we're going to be working out this Monday and, you know, each group's going to have their 10 kids and they're going to stick with that group until we start football, football. I know a couple. I know this one team. I forget. It's like I think it's in Maricopa. Mm-hmm. Uh, they actually shut down their season, their high school team, because of the virus. Junior college. No, no, no. There was one high school team that did. Oh, a high school. A team? high school team did. Like their coaches was like, with all the parents' concerns and our concerns, we're gonna just happen to uh, shut down the season. He was gonna have like uh, six or seven returning seniors. Uh huh. This happened, didn't you know? Turn out. Now that sucks, bro.